Are you deep into the world of search engine optimization, managing guest posts, building backlinks and regularly checking domains? If so, you are in for a right video today. I am Ashish and in this video, we are diving into the world of backlink monitoring with a revolutionary approach. Imagine streamlining your SEO efforts, ensuring the health of your website and catching these sneaky 404 not found error with just one click. If you are nodding your head right now, you know the importance of staying on top of your website health. Managing guest posts, building backlinks and checking domains can sometimes feel like trying to untangle a world of digital chaos. Today, we are also diving into a common online mystery, the case of disappearing backlinks. You might be in for a surprise. So picture this. You agreed with another website with swapping links. It's like a friendly handshake in the digital world. You add their link and they add your links. All seems well, right? But hold on, fast forward a bit and you notice something fishy. Your link or worse, the whole page you agreed upon is nowhere to found on your, their website. It's like they pulled a vanishing act on your digital handshake. But you are now probably wondering, how do I know they ghosted my link? Well, fear not detective, we have got some clues for you. Also imagine this, you have engaged in hoping 1000 of backlinks exchanges every month. This is a lot of a digital handshake, but here is a challenge. Manually checking each one is incredibly time consuming. How do you navigate this sea of links efficiently? We are going to deal step by step solution for this video of all situations are going to explain there. To be aware of your SEO backlink presence, first we will open the Google spreadsheet and give it an appropriate name. Next, we will click on the extension button and select the app script option. As you can see here, the source code of the Google Sheet has been opened to you, so you need to give a suitable name to your project and have to paste the whole script. Here, you will find that the script carries the domain name, atritecrm.com. In front of the self-website text of the code, this shows that we're tracking the backlinks for the mentioned domain. To take the code of this app script functioning, you need to watch out the complete video till the end. Once you have pasted the script, click on the Run button and authorize the permissions by clicking on the Review Permission and selecting a valid email ID. Here, you can see that the execution process has been started and will be completed as well in a little while. As the execution process is completed, we will move back to the Google Sheet and refresh it once. Here, you can see that the Scan and Check button is displayed on the sheet now. For further processing, we will paste some website URLs in the sheet, including some valid or some invalid links. These are the links to the websites on which you have posted your own articles or blog posts. As you will click on the Scan and Check button, you will see that the Running Script tag will show to you at the top of the page. Next to this, the outcome will display it on the page with the name Scan Result, having the details of three categories, successful URLs, failed URLs, and invalid URLs, along with an OK button in the corner. Hence, as you will click on the OK button, the, the whole information will get updated in the sheet with the proper causes and color coding. For a verification check, we will click on the first link of the sheet in which we haven't found any backlinks with the reason of outside website. Next to this, we will click on the second link of the page in which we have found the backlink with the reason targeted URL. As you can see, this article has been published from store.outrightcrm.com, which means this site carries a backlink. Now, we will check out the third link of the sheet in which we have found the failed backlink, error, with the reason, error. Here, you can see that this page is showing error 404, which means the backlink has been removed from the page. And finally, we will move toward the invalid domain link of the sheet with the reasons for outside website. As you can see, this domain is not available now. Therefore, we will move back to the coding section by clicking on the extension and then app script button. As you can see here, we have mentioned scan and check in the creator menu of the script. This means you can run this code to check the backlink via automation with the help of the scan and check button and through manual operation by making a little change in the script. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel.